Hello and in this video, we are going to learn how to remove the header and footer from the first page because usually in a long or formal document, then the first page could be the cover page or the title page and we don't want the header and footer to appear there. We want the header and footer to appear from the second page onwards. Okay, so there are a few ways that this can be done in Word, but let me show you uh, my favorite method and it's probably the easiest and quickest as well. Okay, so first double click anywhere on top or the bottom of the page and this will activate the header and footer toolbar now once it is activated now once it is activated check this option different first page and what it does is that it will hide the header and footer from the first page now let's go and check so nothing appears on the first page and then the header and footer will appear on the second page so this is good but now we have a problem Okay, so nothing appears on the first page, which is exactly what we want. But you can see that the page numbering starts at 2, and this is not what we want. We want page numbering to start at 1 from page 2. So what do we do? Well, just go to page number, go to format page number, and in the page numbering, instead of setting it to start at 1, we'll just set it to 0. And voila! Our job is done. So nothing appears on the first page, but when it does appear on the second page, the header appears on the top and page numbering appears at the bottom and it starts at 1 from page 2, which is exactly what we want. So our problem is solved. Now, many of you might be wondering, is it possible to remove header and footer from the first and the second page? Because usually the first page could be the cover page and then the second page could be the executive summary or sometimes it is a table of contents and the actual content will start from the third page onward. And is it possible to use a previous method, different first page, to remove the header and footer from the first two pages? It is possible to remove header and footer from the first and second page, but we will need to go through another route. We will need to insert a section break. Now, there's one thing that we'll need to be in mind in Word is that any type of page level formatting is applied for a section, not for a page. So, if we want to remove header and footer from the first two pages in the document, then we will need to put them into a section and then put the rest of the document into a different section. Now, this might seem daunting, but it's actually quite simple. All we need to do is to go to the bottom of the second page and then go to layout, go to breaks and select a uh, section breaks next page. Okay, let me just delete this. Okay, now if you go to home and if you click on this weird looking show and hide button, then you can see that there's a section break that appears on the second page and this indicates that the first page and the second page is one section and then the third page onward will be another section okay so now we can start page numbering and header and footer so double click on top on the bottom of the page to activate the header and footer toolbar the default is that the header and footer for the second section will take on the formatting of the first section but we don't want that in this case so let's turn off the same as previous so turn off the link to previous and again so turn off the link to previous okay and now all we need to do is to click on anyway on the first or on the second page header and then select remove header and again click anywhere on the first or the second page footer Go to footer and select remove footer. Now it will work probably. So you can see that nothing appears on the first and second page. And then the header and footer will appear from the third page onwards. And the page numbering will start at one from the third page, which is exactly what we want. So that's it for now. Happy learning and see you in the next video.